This is Front Page Africa coming to you live from the Golden Key, Golden Gate Hotel, where it is believed that the ambassador of Liberia to Nigeria, as and Conte, is, is residing. Some young people and young and students of the Republic of Liberia have gathered here today, calling for the resignation of uh, some Conte because, according to them, Ambassador Conte have compromised the, the rape case involving a seven years old kid that was raped on the compound of the on the compound of the. So let's see the altercation that is ongoing right now. ago from Beach TV we are bringing you a live protest at the grounds of the Golden Golden Gate Hotel where it is believed that the Nigerian amb Liberian ambassador to Nigeria uh, San Conte is being hosted the youth population is calling for his resignation because according to them the He's, he's compromising and uh, he, he has compromised the rape case involving one of his staff that is not basically the Minister of Council of the Embassy. So let's see if we can talk to, let's see if we can talk to the, 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 the spokesperson of the entire protest. Hello and welcome to Pope, uh, Front Page Africa TV and uh, OKFM. Yeah, I see you here in protest, sinking, battle cry, and what have you. What are you doing here? We're here because one year, one year three months ago, um, Ambassador Alassane Kose, who is the Liberian ambassador to Nigeria, compromised a seven year old child sexual abuse case at the Liberian embassy in Nigeria. So we are here to demand him. The ambassador Ahasa Conte to resign as an ambassador because he has threatened our collective effort as human rights campaigners to ensure that Liberia is safe from the scourge of sexual and gender violence. So, how long will you be here? We are here as long as Ambassador Conte is here. An ambassador who says he cannot give a seven year old child justice, we also will not allow him to leave this place. So, you care to explain a bit? about the purpose of the protest because of those are listening who are not following the story 
So Ambassador Al Hassan pointed in April of 2020, a case was reported involving a seven-year-old man who was sexually abused at the Liberian Embassy in Nigeria. The case was reported to him as an ambassador, but he paid death here. He did not pay more attention to it. So at the end of uh, at the end of the day, the child will not access good health care. The child will not access justice. Up to then, the, the child is facing internal pains in her anus and vagina. But this ambassador is still lottery the principal school of Morovia. He is foreign here at this holding gate hotel, and this is why we are here to tell him to resign. If he does not resign, we'll mount, you know, the um, on the street of Morovia at the Morovia. Foreign Affairs, the Liberal Foreign Affairs Minister to ask the President where the President stays to run our, our, our country to enable the Ambassador to resign. If that cannot happen, we have a continuous strike in this country because rape is a national emergency as declared by the President of the Republic of Liberia. Do you think the action you are taking here today, do you think it is a referral action? It is civil. It is civil. We do these things when public officials have been looking to take action on critical national issues. We do not just come here because we hear about this case, one day, we come one day. We heard about this case, we investigated this case, and in fact, it is proven by the Nigerian government that this child was not just raped once, she was raped twice. So just imagine, so we investigated fully, and we in communication with the Federal Republic of Nigeria government to show that um, Ambassador Asan Conte cannot go back to Nigeria and serve as Liberian Ambassador in that country because he has betrayed the children of Liberia, betrayed our collective effort against such and So what guarantee you, do you have that indeed Ambassador Conte is in a particular hotel? You, you know, we, we are, we are, we are, we are at the human rights areas. We are very good at information. We got the information very soon. We knew um, the flight he came with. He came with Air Cote d'Ivoire. That's the first establishment. And he's also here in room 204. Room 204 Golden Gate Hotel. Al Hassan Conte Ambassador. Al Hassan Conte is in that hotel. And we want him to come out. He's in our hotel room 204. He's there. So we know all of this information. So this is why we are telling Ambassador Al Hassan Conte to resign. We are here to tell him that when people are serious about this matter, because rape has been declared a national emergency, and we cannot have a public official compromising the issue of sexual gender around our trust like you. Then threat is and honor our collective effort at human rights and freedom. So we want, we want to be thinking, well, what is it that this issue has happened and the Ministry of Gender is there, the Ministry of Foreign Affairs is there, I'm told that the, the Senate of Tinder investigated the matter, we have to come this investigation. What exactly uh, can your part not be directed to other the Ministry of Foreign Affairs where Ambassador um, Kanda has been appointed? We have two bullets. One is directed to the Ministry of Gender. The Ministry of Gender will give on the, the government 24 hours, 48 hours of ultimatum. If the Ministry of Gender, who has the statutory responsibility to protect and promote the well being of children and women across Liberia, cannot come out to provide for the Liberian people an investigative report or result of their investigation, we will also ask the government, the same government, President George Manor, we are to ensure that the Minister of Gender in the Republic of Liberia, Mr. Peace of City, Tark, and Rizan. And if for any reason, D. Maswa Kemeya, who is the Liberian Foreign uh, Ministry, uh, ministers, if he does not do something about it, because we also know that he was a, it was alleged that he had sexually harassed one of his working, you know, um, police when he was at the UN. So if he does not do anything, hey, you have me there. If he does not do anything about this case, we will also continue to have several, you know, match against Liberia. Yes. I guess, so this is front page TV. We still here at Gordon Gordon uh, Kate Hotel. Witnessing the we have the government issue. We have somebody here that runs our public issue. We have all the evidence that proves that we compromise this case because it happened one year, three months ago. To date, he hasn't been able to show up to, to provide for us the impersonal investigative report, nor the investigative report that we should have in the public for so showing that this child has access to justice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, who have here in Nigeria. So that's why we are here. We're not here because we don't want to sign your yeah, yeah. prisons and the victims against the world. But we're here to ask the ambassador to resign. And we're also here to allow him to know that we are concerned about this case. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Are you a journalist? I'm not a journalist. I'm a supervisor of how conscious, 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 how conscious
Ok. Et Open the for the people That is the voice. That is the voice of the supervisor of the private security firm, owned by former former police director for a couple of operations, Ibi Koma. It is the power of security. So we bring you live from bring you live from Golden Gate Hotel, where scores of young people have gathered in protest calling for the resignation of Liberian ambassador to Nigeria as a contest for compromise for allegedly compromising a rape case involving a seven years old kid who was raped by two 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 minors at the embassy of of Liberia in Nigeria. So we are here we are here bringing you life we are here bringing you live of the protest bringing you live
So what you want to do here? Serious altercation between a Private security officers are calling on the protesters to leave the, the compounds of the hotel where Ambassador Ah San Quentin is believed to be residing. But he has bothered with he has bothered with serious resistance from the protesters that they are not moving until the Barbara National Police can arrive and have engaged engagement with them. So this is Front Page Africa TV. We are bringing you live. We are bringing you live. We are bringing you live from.
So this is from British Africa. We're still here at the grounds of the Golden Gates Hotel, bringing you live protests with young people, school of young people who are in protest, who are demanding the resignation of our South Contra Nigerian ambassador to Nigeria. We see now the arrival of the police, the engagement has started. Let's see how it ends. So the police is still engaging them to see how best they can leave the compounds of the, of the hotel. So the engagement is ongoing. The police and the protesters are in, are, are in conversation right now. So let's see how it ends. The private security have, have failed because they have... So the intervention of the Labrador National Police